A Delaware County apartment complex is going to extreme lengths to deal with residents who do not clean up after their dogs. Our Joe Holden in this Marple Township right now to explain what's going on. Joe, good evening. Yuki, good evening. We have an interesting situation on our hands here. Dogs, dog waste, people who feel strongly about what is going on. There's frustration, there's support, and at the end, these flyers that were handed out to all of the tenants here who have dogs saying this is their DNA solution for dog waste that will eliminate any wrongful accusations regarding unscooped waste. One apartment complex in Delaware County hopes to flush its doggy number two problem down the toilet. They're asking all of the pet owners to get the DNA for their dogs. Oh, goodness. I'm a big fan of technology. This is kind of a... Uh... Are you freaking kidding me? Governor Sproul management has grown tired of party pooper tenants not picking up after their four-legged friends. They even offer free bags on the property and a friendly reminder to clean up. I didn't realize that we had a, a dog poo problem. So a quick swab. That's good. Right up the cheek. Mm -hmm. And chances DNA will be entered into a database at a company called Poo Prints. If by chance he leaves his business behind and maintenance workers find it, they'll grab a sample and send it to the company. With a match, that could trigger a $250 fine. I mean, I know people don't pick up after their dogs, but DNA testing is kind of ridiculous. Maybe it will help prevent so much crap around the community. Mimi Hartman is Governor Sproul property manager. This is cutting edge. <laughs> yeah. yeah, cutting edge, definitely. <laughs> they saw the doggy duty DNA concept at a trade show. And since they rolled it out, you know, we are seeing a decrease in, you know, the, the piles that are out on the property. <laughs> mm -hmm. Tenants must swab their dogs. Nearly 75% have already complied. It's actually now an addendum to their lease. Yeah, I think people should be held accountable for their animals the same way they should be held accountable for their children. Well, we are told the property is looking cleaner. In fact, they add up a 50% slash in what they found out here at one time. And as for those who will not comply, apparently, according to this paperwork, that will also get you a fine. Live in Marple Township tonight, I'm Joe Holton, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Okay. Joe, thanks.